Dear students, welcome to our third lesson in this series. In this lesson, it's an introduction to orthographic projection. Here we'll know what orthographic projection stands for. Orthographic projection stands for originally projecting the surface of an isometric pictorial drawing, the 3D object. Why we are doing that? We are doing that to have the detailed dimensions of a particular component in order to calculate the dimension of the raw material that needed for its production and we'll cut this material and make our object at least three views of a component must be deduced and drawn to do so you must imagine having the object you are deducing the view of directly in front of your site we'll have at least three views front view this is the view obtained by looking at the object from the front side view this is the view obtained by looking at the object from the top side top view this is the view obtained by looking at the object from the above let us see some examples here we have a 3d object that will deduce the views for we are looking from the front left side or right side from the other from the top of them or the bottom so we have six views for any 3d object how do we look to the front view to look to the front view as we said we have to take our object in front of our site and look to the surface that we see in the front here we see this uh, this one this one and our cylinder here our web this is the front view how can we deduce the side view in order to deduce the side view we have to look from the left side or from the right side as we see they are similar almost to deduce the top view we have to look from the above this is our top view, this is our base, this is our cylinder, and here we have some grooves, we'll explain them after. So, we go back, we have front view, we have side view from this way, and we have top view when we are looking from the above. This is the three main views that we'll explain how to draw. Goodbye.